because I was kicking people. Yeah, you don't do that when you're about to get tied up. It makes the ropes cut into your ankles and you're held upside down for a really long time and people are hurting you and it was a cater event and the only people that said something or had the balls to say something were two firefighters. They found out how old I was and they said no. And they were like, no, we done. We out, we out. No, we're not doing that. No, no, we're good. They didn't call anybody. They didn't fight anybody. They didn't stop anything from happening. They just left. In Los Angeles, California. Los Angeles, California. More specifically, Simi Valley. And Fifteen. I lived in a Mexican foster home in Riverside County, under Riverside County CPS protection. Mm -hmm. I called them. We told them what was going on. I told them what happened. They didn't want to hear it. Well, see yo, thank y'all for tuning in to another requested video. As I always like to express in all my other videos, I am not here to turn non-believers into believers. I'm only here to bring y'all food for thought. And with that being said, your opinion is your opinion. Let's get right down to it. As always, like always, I do want to give Ali Carter her flowers while she is still here. Thank you, Ali Carter. We appreciate you. Ashe continue to be a voice and not an echo and with that being said we are very grateful for your existence it's very interesting the things that ali carter had to endure in order for her to be able to speak today and let us know everything that goes down behind these closed doors and not only do i know that ali carter is telling the truth if y'all want to know in detail exactly what she refers to y'all should definitely read this book called mind control by Tracy Twyman. She helps you understand certain things that are taking place when you are under the ultra effect and when you are part of the CT movement. Let's be clear, these politicians are going to do their best to change the narrative and to make us believe that these certain things didn't happen. But if you understand, you understand that don't trust everything you see. Even salt looks like sugar and that these people really could be pulling something over your eyes. And with that being said, if you function with me on a monthly, daily, weekly basis, y'all already understand that clear eyes always recognize real lies. And like always, I'm always going to have more. Ali Carter, again, we appreciate you. In your rough times, understand that the struggle you're in today is only giving you the strength you'll need for tomorrow. Life is 10% what happens to us and 90% how we react to it. So we have to face it, fight it, and finish it. We are warriors, not warriors. Bushido. That way. That part. Why though? Michael and I also want to acknowledge. Uh... I mean, this dude is a genius.